Alright guys, we're out here in the freezing cold. It's in the 20s. It's January 1st. And uh, I'm here with Chris. And uh, first good find of the day. Well, we got a couple of decent finds, but nothing special. But there's a nice silver coin, quarter size, I think. So hopefully, it's something good. I'll let him do the honors. It's not aluminum, it's is aluminum. it? Aluminum. I thought it was. It's I was aluminum. gonna say. I was gonna say it looks aluminum, aluminum, but I didn't want to kill the spirits. No, it's aluminum. It's a kid's token, right? Yeah, it's gonna be presidential. That's token still cool. Yeah, it's still cool. What's that say? It says 1901. 1901. That's what that says. All right. If it's really 1901, that's pretty good. Yeah, presidential token. Nice. That's cool. Which president is it? It says 1897 to 1901. Okay. So who is that? All you history buffs out there, who is that? <laughs> William McKinley. William McKinley, cool. Okay. All right, we'll be back. Uh All right, first good coin of the year is a vehicle. Can't uh, tell the date, it's pretty corroded. But I'm happy to have it. Back's pretty nice. Cool. All right, let's see if we can find some more. All right, Chris just got a good coin. It's an Indian, his first of the year. And looks like it's got to be cleaned up pretty good because a lot of crud on the top, but that's cool. It's kind of dark over here. But that's where he found it, right there. Not too far from the house. Cool. Be back with something else if you find anything. Well, I don't normally show pocket knives unless they're silver, uh, but this is the smallest one I've ever found. This thing's tiny and it's uh, pretty cool looking. So I thought I'd show it down there pretty deep. All right, we'll be back. All right, we just got something here that uh, Dominique from Silver Slingers is going to be jealous of. A nice little bell here. This is Chris's. You just found it right over there. And that's a nice little relic. All right. And uh, oh, we forgot to show this from earlier. Look at the size of this lock. This thing is huge. Things uh, somebody somebody cut it at some point to get into it. You can see it was cut right there. Got a really nice one. That's an old one. I mean, this thing is heavy, very heavy, heavy duty. The back says car lock on it, so that's cool. And then he found a pocket knife. So we both found pocket knives today. This wasn't and uh, oh yeah, he found a. This is the other day. This is the other day, but he found a nice little toy gun. I found two of them. I'll show them later. All right, that's what we got so far. It's starting to get dark. We'll probably be winding up soon, so hopefully we find something else before we go. Okay, guys, we just discovered something really cool about this bell. He was cleaning it out, and uh, hold on to that for a second. This thing right here, that's a tomback button they were using to cling it with. That's crazy. How cool is that? Let me get a better shot here. Look at that. Pretty sure it's Tom back. It's either that or silver plated, but it looks Tom back. Unbelievable.
That's pretty neat. That's pretty cool. So we'll show that to you cleaned up later. Hey guys, day two, uh, my first decent find, um, don't know what it is, watch fob maybe, looks like it could be, but it's real heavy, it's not silver, ringing up in the 30s, but uh, kind of cool, those letters are stamped in there real, it wasn't done by a machine, looks like by hand so need if anybody knows let me know all right guys finally I got silver in the hole had to chop through this stuff look at that that is solid all that is solid frozen I had to go through four inches of at least four inches where'd it go here there we go of ice and there it is right there Deeper. I can't, I can't see where I am. Where'd it go? Under that. Oh yeah, it's under the roof. Trying to film and get this out at the same time. Uh, what is it? And it's just a Merc, but cool. I'll take it first silver of the year. What is it? 40s? Yep, 40 something. 41. Cool, it's silver. We'll hopefully be back with some more. Alright, guys, I'm super pumped. Look at what just came out of this hole right here. Unbelievable. We've actually moved on to like a farm field. You can see right there in the background, Chris is over there. And, uh,. I just pulled this badass out. Bad baby. Awesome. This I think this is the best shoe buckle I found. Completely intact. That is awesome. A little bent, but we'll take it. I'm gonna go put this back in the car right now, so it don't bend it anymore. All right, we'll be back with some more to get this cleaned up and show it to you at the end. It looks like this is going to be a shoe buckle field. My second one. That sucker was down there deep too. That's probably about eight, nine inches down. Sweet. I was thinking that was going to be a coin. It was a coin signal. Awesome. Happy with that. Be back. All right, literally probably about two or three minutes later, I find this big flat button, and I think it's Tom back. It's cleaning off pretty good. Maybe. At any rate, it's a nice one. Be back. All right, Chris brought me a clump of dirt here, and he thinks it's a tie clip or a money clip. Look at the words on it. Let's see if you can see what it says. It's tough to see. John, J O H. God, pull it. Somebody's on. name. All right. 
Ooh. A little bit of this paired off. Oh yeah. That's awesome looking. You wanna rub it off? Something pretty cool, right? Yeah, it's got a neat design on it. Alright. Jewels. On the yeah. left and the right. That is sweet looking. Look at this thing. Johnny Star Jewelers. Jewelers. Alright. Let's take a look. There we go. Bangkok, Thailand. <laughs> sweet. That's a beautiful piece. That is pretty neat. Oh yeah. Like you were saying, I'd rather see that than a silver coin, silver yep. dime. This stuff is rare. You don't find this stuff all the time. It's got a number on it. Something box 422 PO. It's an address, PO box 422. And then another number on the other side. Just went out of focus here. Something with another number. That's cool. Maybe that's the zip code. I don't know. Sweet. Good job. Yeah, that's a money clip, definitely. All right. He's on board, board with a good find. <laughs> Let's see the smile for the camera there. Yeah, uh huh. It's been a rough day for him so far. Yeah, that was it. That made his day. That made his day. We'll be back.